How to write blog posts quickly. Hiya, Adam Payne here with the Video Marketing Insider and that is exactly what we're gonna be talking about in this video. I'm gonna show you how easy it is to write a blog post on any topic. We'll actually do this live and I'm gonna do it on a topic that I know very little about. If you've got a blog or a website, you'll know the importance of continually publishing good quality content. It's important, but it's easier said than done. A lot of us suffer from a lack of creativity. We often get writer's block, and other times it just takes time to think of, write out, proofread and edit content before it's ready to publish. So let's get started. So I've got a timer ready, and I've got a topic in mind that I don't know anything about. I've just typed it in. What are the health benefits of honey? I don't have a website or blog related to health, related to honey or any of this kind of stuff, but I've just typed this in to give you an idea. And I'm also gonna be using a third party tool called conversion.ai, which is gonna help me write the content really, really quickly. So first of all, we're over here at Google and I've typed in the phrase that I'm gonna write my blog post about. Now, before we um, get started, let me come over here and let me hit start. So we've got the timer going. The first thing I do when I'm at Google is I come down to these questions and I open one and I close it again. And I open another one and I close it again. And I open another one and I close it again. And we keep doing this because as you can see, the number of questions gets bigger and bigger. And this is really, really good information because when somebody types in what are the health benefits of honey, they're also interested in similar things here. And these could be great subheadings for our article. So we've got that there, okay? So we've now got a bunch of questions that we could write stuff about. I'm then gonna come, I'm gonna copy this first, because I'm gonna need this in a second. I'm gonna copy that, I'm gonna come to conversion.ai. I'm gonna hit long form assistant. And I'm gonna put here uh, a blog post um, tell it, telling people, and I'm gonna paste this in here, what the health benefits of honey are. And I'm gonna hit continue. And then I'm gonna hit generate ideas. And it's gonna give me some titles for my blog post. And I'll be able to choose from one of these. So what could we see here? Um, honey's natural healing. Let's choose this one. Okay, we'll choose that one. And we'll click generate ideas. And this is also gonna give us an introduction paragraph that we can use for our article. So we've got a couple of things that we can use. Um, let's use this one, open editor. So now we have this paragraph here. Just to make sure this is completely unique, I'm gonna copy this. I'm gonna come over here to a tool called Copyscape. I'm gonna paste this in and hit premium search, just to make sure that we are not plagiarizing. As we can see, we've got 72 words, it's cost us three cents, and this is unique content. So come back over to conversion.ai. I'm gonna hit this little power mode up here. I'm then gonna copy this up here, that's my title. I'm then gonna come down to blog post outline and I'm gonna paste this in here. And then I'm gonna hit generate AI content. Now this tool is going to give us some subheadings that we can use along with, we can use these ones of course, let's just click off of there. So let's come back over here and let's just see what this brings up for now. And we'll see how we can get to a thousand words. So let's see, hmm. honey is a natural healing power. So I'm just gonna copy this one, I don't want all of these because they don't all, um, they're not all gonna flow perfectly. I'm gonna come over here, I'm gonna put hashtag, hashtag, because this is how this software works. Now this is kind of like an H2 tag. Honey is a natural healing power. So I'm gonna put something, I'm gonna give Jarvis a prompt. So honey has many natural, and then down here, I'm gonna switch to long. I'm gonna make sure I spell this correctly. And then I'm gonna hit compose and just watch what happens. It's going to actually start writing content for us. And we'll come down here and we might have to, you know, proofread a little bit. Um, let's make sure it's strong enough. Okay, let's get rid of that, bingo. Okay, so now we've got this 197 words and it's taken us three minutes. And I've been demonstrating this. If I was doing this without making a video, it may have been a minute quicker. So we're gonna come back over here and we're gonna come down here. Now I'm just gonna take this. What are the disadvantages of honey? So I'm gonna copy this. I'm gonna come here and I'm gonna enter, enter, hashtag, hashtag. Um, and I'm gonna say, despite the known benefits, 
benefits. Honey has some disadvantages. And then I'm going to hit compose again. Now, actually, I don't know if honey has disadvantages or not, but we'll find out. Let's see what it says here. Honey may contain bacteria. Okay, it's believed honey could cause a yeast infection. Okay, so we've got we'll get rid of this bit there. That didn't make any sense. Um, okay, so that's cool. So now we've got we've nearly got three hundred words. Let's come back over here and let's see this one. What's the best time to take honey? Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to um, copy this and we'll carry on the process. So we'll. Um, hashtag hashtag what's the best time to take honey and then just hit compose and let's see what this does here honey is great for any time of the day in general honey should be taken 30 minutes before or after a meal so look we're getting all this content and look look at the word count going up um, I'm gonna get rid of that last bit because it says I and I'm just gonna take all of this and just double check this again over here so we'll delete that plonk it in there and hit premium search and we'll see, brilliant. So again, this is completely new content. So you can see how quick this is here. So I'm gonna show you a different thing we can do now to get this um, moving quicker. So let's see, clearly people ask this, um, when should I eat honey, morning or night? So first let me copy this and do the same process, but I'm not gonna um, write the paragraph or get, them to, get Jarvis to write the paragraph. I'm gonna use it as a header, and then I'm gonna come back and I'm gonna bring this down and I'm just gonna copy this. Now obviously I can't, use this content as is because it's not mine to use. Did that copy? I'm not sure, but let's copy that. I'm going to come back over here and I'm going to switch to content improver. This one up here, this is really useful. And then I'm going to get rid of that, plonk it in, and I'm going to have them give me five variations of this. I'll hit generate AI content and we'll see what this brings up. It's going to give us basically options that we can use. So let's come down here. So raw honey, okay. We've got that one. So let's copy that one and let's see if this passes copyscape. So again, we've got to delete all this. Um, we're gonna, oh, got a lot more to delete, obviously. Delete that, plonk it in, premium search. It may or it may not, we'll find out. If it, if it doesn't, we won't use it, but it does. So now we can come over here and we can plonk that in there. So now we've got up to like 470 words. We'll come back over here and you kind of get the idea. Um, let's choose something else. Um, what are the benefits of drinking hot water with honey? I don't know the answer to that, but we can come over here. Again, we've got a headline. I won't bother with the hashtag because I'm just gonna use the content improver now and I'm going to copy this, copy, come back, Come back to the top here, delete all of that. And we get 600 characters that we can use, so this is fine. We're gonna hit generate AI content again, and we'll see what this spits out, and then we'll just double check it using Copyscape. So again, we're just gonna wait a little bit. Um, I don't know if this is gonna be unique or not, so let's copy that, come over here, delete, paste, premium search. No results, 119 words there, so let's, Put that in there. So what are we up to now? We're now up to 600 words and it's taken us seven minutes on a topic that we know nothing about. So let's get this up to a thousand words because that's what I promised. Okay, so can honey with hot water reduce weight? Now, of course, when you did this for real, you may want to make sure that the um, subheadings would flow naturally one after the other, but this just shows you how super quick this is and it's really, really cool. Imagine just doing this, in, you know, you could spend like 20 minutes, you have a blog post with say 1,500 words, you copy and paste it into your WordPress editor, maybe format it a little bit, add some images, um, and you'd be good to go. So let's, what can we choose here? What did the first thing say? Honey mix with warm water and lemon. Okay, let's choose this first one. Copy clipboard, delete, paste, premium search again. Uh, okay, so this one didn't pass Copyscape, so that's fine. We'll come back over here and we'll see if this one is, does, I should say. And if it doesn't, we'll just try something different. Click. A bit of a loud click, wasn't it? Okay, this one did, so copy that. Bring that over here. 
Okay, so now we're up to 650 words. So let's um, come down here, eager to lose weight. Let's just read this. So this drink is one of the most popular diet hacks around because experts say it can help you flush toxins from your system while also regulating your weight in the long term. Let's hit compose and see if it adds more to this paragraph. So we've got, look, now we're getting more stuff. This is really, really cool. Look at the word count going up. Okay, so this is really good into your okay into your routine we can finish that off ourselves. let's um get this up i want to do something else so uh, how much honey should you eat in a day now it's a bit short is honey and hot water good for your lungs well that actually flows on with the one previously so i'm sorry if this isn't much fun to watch this video but you can see that this is a really cool way of just crafting content and it's super quick so again we'll copy this copy We'll come back over here, we'll do the same process again, delete, paste, generate AI content. We'll then pick one of the paragraphs that this software spits out. And again, I'm so impressed with this software, it's really, really cool. Um, so let's just copy that one for now. We'll just won't bother with Copyscape for now because you've seen how that works. We'll just keep it like this and then we'll hit Compose again. And we'll try and get this up to a thousand words as soon as we can. Let's see. Do, 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 do. So we look. Uh, okay, hit one to the city in the house. Okay, let's um, get rid of that. So, in traditional Chinese medicine, honey was considered to be one of the most effective remedies against coughs and sore throats due to its ability to break up mucus, deposit, mucus deposits in the lungs. This was part. And then we just start writing. Look, and it particularly. And then we hit compose and let's see if this can just bring it over to a thousand words look at this bingo a thousand words we got it there how long did this take us it took us 10 minutes and 43 seconds now if i wasn't demonstrating the back and forth between copyscape it may have taken say nine minutes ten minutes then what i would do from here is i would copy this and I would go over to my WordPress editor, I'd paste it in, I'd make some subheadings, H2 tags, add images and, you know, optimize it and all of that fun stuff, which might take me an extra 10 or 15 minutes. I'm not going to go over that in this video. And then that would be it. And now I've got an article written super, super quickly and it's past Copyscape. So it's unique content. Now, you're still probably going to have to read through it once by yourself just to double check everything makes sense and it flows and you might have to delete a little bit here and there but for the most part super super quick so i thought that was a pretty simple process if you want to check out conversion.ai i've got a video which you can check out click the little eye to the right to the top right of this video you can see that i'll leave a link in the description as well fantastic piece of kit and yeah, thank you for watching. I hope this video showed you that there are tools out there that can really help you write blog posts quickly and reduce a lot of the stress that you may have in trying to come up with ideas for content and write all this stuff out. If you enjoyed this video, please give me a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, hit the bell notification, and I'll see you in another video shortly. Take care. Thank you for watching. If you've got any questions or you need more clarification, go and watch the video once more. Over on the right hand side, we have some more trainings and reviews, so go and watch those as well. Please hit the like button, subscribe to the channel if you've not done so already, and hit the bell notification. Other than that, ask any questions you've got below and I'll see you soon.